Hey guys, welcome back to Eric Reacts with more Dragon Quest XI. Uh, I was really enjoying this game, but then we had some graphical issues. Uh, I just couldn't record fast enough. Um, yeah, the frame rate was dropping really low, especially when I went to Heliodor. So, uh, whenever we would go to, uh, I'm guessing in the future, if we went to different uh, big cities, it would just we would run into the same issues. So I got a GTX 1080s graphics card. So it's running much smoother, as you can see, it's like 60 frames per second. Uh, I'm only recording at 30 frames per second though, so you won't see how great this is. But, um, yeah, hopefully in the meantime you've been watching some Spider-Man videos, and GTX 1080 looks awesome. Uh, I'm gonna sell everything I have, all my worldly possessions, all my old games, to see if I can actually afford it retroactively. Um, but yeah. Let's continue. I actually forget what I was doing. It's been a while. <laughs> now we know where Derek is, we just need to figure out how we get past that dog. Uh. Right. Right, so we needed to borrow a dog from this person here. Uh, actually, I don't know who to borrow it from. Looking for a dog. Anybody have a dog? Oh. Why do I think it was going to be this way? Alright. Let's go find that dog. Shall we? Do you have a dog? Do you have a dog? Also, this is running smoother at much higher graphical settings, whereas before it was like minimum settings and I still couldn't run the freaking game. Alright, here's a dog. Okay, I, I see a little graphical stutter right now, but... That great big coward of a guard nearly weed himself when he saw you. What do you think you're staring at? Get lost. You what? You want to borrow my dog? You're having a giraffe, ain't ya? <coughs> look, I ain't got time for this. Go on, Slinger. You Slinger, look. Bullseye ears at lone wolf like me. The young takes kindly to strangers. Ah, but you know what? Some holy water and a buzzberry or two might change his mind. Oh, I actually got holy water from that, uh, sham of a fortune teller. I don't think I have buzzberries, though. Alright, fine. I'll go get some buzzberries. We'll do that. That should be pretty. Oh, no, not this way. Oh, now I gotta run all the way back here. I did up the graphical settings. Mm, it did slow down just a second ago, so maybe I'll... I'll see. Maybe I'll reduce the resolution. Right now it's running at 4K, which... I've never run anything at 4K. Oh, I actually don't care about, like, high graphical fidelity and, like great resolution. I just want everything to run like high FPS. Yeah, it's still... It's, it's running much better than before, but I'm actually going to change it right now. Uh, sorry, guys. And... Yeah, I'm still keeping this low, because that increases... I'm going to make this window for a second, so that I can actually change the resolution to 1920. Oh, whoops. And borderless. Should make it bigger, right? There we go. Hopefully that's better. Should be, right? Hi, enemies. Oh, oh. Whoa! Totally forgot. Didn't see them. Oh, it's nice seeing the enemies at these high frames rates, too. So smooth, I love it. How come I got to go twice before Eric went twice? He's a thief, he should be faster. Oh, now he did. He was Oh, where did you say the bulbs were? It looks like it's right there, but. Is it? Could it be? No? Okay. One, buzzberries. Yep, there we go. That's all I need, right? Oh, hi. Hi. So that's a short detour. Okay. Still getting some frame drops. But it's not... It's much better than before. Like, completely acceptable frame drops. If I wanted to, I could just reduce the resolution to the lowest and then, like, turn off anti-aliasing and everything else. But... Alright, this game has some control issues, too, which I'm not gonna get into. Hopefully the recording is fine. I'm gonna go check later. 
Alright, here we go. I'm gonna... Bring these things to the dog. Hi, little lady. Do you think I was just gonna add me over dog to some stranger? Alright. That's what I asked for, blimey. Yay, let's share these. <laughs> She's a cute little girl. What? Don't look at me like that. Bullseye looks me after me, and I look after him. Anyway, a promise is a promise. Easier is for a bit. Look after him, alright? Go pl and play with the nice man for a bit, okay? Arf, woof, woof. Oh. Oh, he's actually literally, like, just following me? Nice. Maybe I'll turn off shadows. What do you guys think? Do you guys care about shadows? Like, it looks... The game looks completely different without shadows. It looks actually... Yeah. That looks a little too bright, actually. Uh... This looks a little better, I guess. I don't... I don't even know if this looks better or not. It just looks different to me. None. Like, it doesn't... None of this looks... I guess this one looks a little better. Like, close inspection. But... I don't know. I'll go at two. See, I don't really notice, notice the difference between even none and one. Like, what... What difference is there? I don't see anything, guys. I'll keep it at one though. Mm, I'm gonna turn off the turn the brightest a little higher. I think eh, 55, because it looks a little darker. All right, let's go mess up this guard's day. Halt! This gate leads to the nice part of town. Oh, pish posh. My job is to protect respectable people from being bothered by rabble and riffraff. In other words, you. Oh, screw you. <laughs> Go get him, Doug. Ah! No, no, not a, 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 a dog. Anything but that. <laughs> <laughs> Worked like a charm. Now to head up to where all the rich folks live and find out what the heck Dirk thinks he's up to. Do you guys think Dirk is on our side? I have a feeling he is. I have a strong feeling that he's on our side. It just doesn't seem like something he would do to betray Eric that way. Where am I going? I don't know how to get... Oh, okay. And where's Dirk? Alright, I'm getting some frame rate loss here. But hopefully it's acceptable. I'll check the video afterwards. Can we just go straight through here? He's in the probably in the upper corner, right? Cars aren't gonna let us oh, we gotta find another way. Okay. We heard. Like, if he stole the orb for himself, he's probably be in the upper corner, because he would sell things and then... Then again... I don't know, can we talk to someone about this? I want to talk to this pink person. Hi. Looking for a shop, Dirk? I feel like someone lives in the big mansion by the castle. Okay, I was, my instincts were right. Use the rope up here in the roof. Okay. I need to be able to jump up to get there. Okay. Thank you. Oh, the leaves are in my way. I think I might have to lower graphical fidelity just a little bit. Because it's running at like 30... It's running at 45 most of the time in the city. But then it'll drop once in a while. Sometimes when I'm running. There's just... I mean, it makes sense. The city is huge and a bunch of things are happening here. Alright, let's check this one first. Did we get it? First try? Nice. Hey, Dirk. <laughs> wow, nice place you got here. Welcome, welcome. Feel free to browse. You'll find we only stock the very finest wings. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. 
because I'm looking for something very special indeed. Happen to have any orbs in stock? No way. Uh, Eric! <laughs> Long time no see, old pal. Ooh, don't go into that confrontation. Uh, oh, whoa. <laughs> Eric! My, my brother! My god Is he trying to hug him? My partnering crime is... Oh, That's actually really funny. It's really... You! <laughs> large as life and... Oh, fighting fit! I'm so... <laughs> Happy to see ya! Wait, this guy's supposed to be a thief? I think thieves are normally like really skinny, get into small places, and can move really fast. You have no shame, huh? Get your backstabbing hands off of me! Eric kind of jumped to conclusions. Yeah. Backstabbing? Does he look you backstabber were to you? You full of it, Dirk. But this hmm. really takes the cake. Admit it. You sold me out and sold the orb so you could buy this place, didn't you? No. I never! I promise you, I never sold you out! I was worried sick Aww. about you. I only opened this place to try and help you! <laughs> oh yeah, and how does that work, exactly? How does you opening this place and lining your pockets while I rot in jail help me? Hmm. Look, I was never much of a thief, you know that. But it turns out, I know how to sell stuff. I got a gift. Even if I do say so myself. <sighs> when you got nabbed, I spent months racking my brains for ways of busting you out. I couldn't stand the thought of you Aww, being. He's a sweet in guy. There. He's a sweet guy. In the end, I realized I'd have to give up the orb. I took it to the king, mm. told him I found it somewhere, and pocketed the reward. Then I used the cash to open up the shop here. And poured all my profits into bribing the guards up at the castle oh. so they'd let you escape. Yeah, it's kind of a suspicious that they just let him dig a huge hole in the middle of the cell. Even if it is covered up. Now that you mention it, I did think it was weird they <laughs> never tossed my cell exactly. the whole time I was digging that hole. Exactly. Exactly! <laughs> I was paying him to turn a blind eye, weren't I? Weren't you? <laughs> Aww. He's a cutie. <sighs> And he's happier okay, here. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I doubted you, partner. Good job. That's a good apology. That's a spirit. Here we go, pal. It's so good to have you back. It's a good apology. He doesn't make excuses for why he did what he did for suspecting him. He's just like, I'm sorry for doing what I did. It's a good apology. But I need that orb. And now Wait, we why do you need the orb? know where it is. Why do you need the orb? <laughs> oh, yes, we do. Right this way, gentlemen. Wait, how do you... Did you sell... Did you give the king a fake? Mm -hmm. that, that, he's <laughs> jolly old fellow. All right, I guess we're following him. And... So, where is it? After I handed over the orb, I made sure to keep my ears to the ground hmm. about where it ended up. I knew it was important to you, see? So why is it important to Eric? Well, Beyond the fact that a little bird tells me that Eric and his men took it to the King's Barrow, and it's huh. been under lock and key there ever since. King's Barrow. The King's Barrow, huh? Mm -hmm. Where's that? <laughs> he just points. It's that way. That's southeast of town. Same direction as Cobblestone. Oh boy, same direction? So we might have guards. Yeah. Which means we can kill two birds with one stone. You coming, Dirk? A little adventure for old time's sake? I didn't see him in the trailer, so probably not. Sorry, no can do. Oh, wow, he got I've got married. a shop to run. Cool. I'm a married man these days. Oh, man. I guess his wife is going to be real happy that... Or his partner is going to be real happy that... He's not... They have more money now, now that he's not bribing the guards. Married? Wow, you really have changed. Well, you always said you wanted to settle down and maybe go into business someday. I'm happy for you. Hmm. We'd better get going. Take care, Dirk, and thanks for everything. That's the dream, right? Not working for yourself and being with someone you love. You too, old pal. Be lucky, eh? 
And don't you two go doing anything I wouldn't do. <laughs> Did Dirk even introduce us to each other? The South Gate is crawling with guards. We won't be walking out that way. And Hendrick's men are too uptight to take bribes. Hmm. Guess we'll have to go the long way round. If we skirt round the hills to the south, we should be able to approach the King Sparrow from the other side. We Sounds can drop good. into cobblestone on the way. Okay, let's head back downtown. Sounds Watch good. Watch yourselves out there, eh? They don't call that forest round there the Mangle Grove for nothing. The Mangle Grove? Going there and never come out. The Mangle Grove sounds dangerous, <laughs> as in a little It'll mangle. It'll take more than a few yeah. kids stories to scare us off. And besides, it's the only way to get there. All right, let's go then. Uh, hmm. How do we? How do we get here? Oh, I see the box now. There we go. Yep. Come on. Should really do those side quests, but I'm not feeling it right now. How do I? Where do I go now? Oh, just fall and then go to the south area. Oops. Oh, did I not break these before? Or did they respawn? Hmm. I have no way of knowing now. Lost, confused. Downtown Heliodor. Oh, stop! Oh god. Yeah, the controls are finicky. I feel like. I try to turn a little bit, and it turns a lot more. Come on. Walk. Run. Forward. You know what? In the future, I'm just gonna turn the camera. To turn where I'm going instead of turning. Yeah, it's much better this way. All right, let's go outside. We're heading to Mangle Grove. I'll end the video right after we get there. Any sign of them? Nope. No, nothing. Let's search the town again. We just exited from there and they missed us. Look at all those lights. They're pretty keen to find us, huh? Yeah. You better steer clear of Heliodor until the heat dies down. Sounds good. All right, through the Mangle Grove and onto Cobblestone. Let's do this. Dun, 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 dun. Did I finish this quest? I don't remember. Hi. Oh, yes, I didn't finish it. You don't need to. You did it. You nailed it, all right. Okay, Normally, I like reading everything that's happening, but there's just too much text in this game. Uh, I read it just then by myself, but not out loud. Gold chain, yay. You've transgressed with this. Okay. So let's see. Gold chain, okay. Uh, raises defense by one, maximum HP by five, and charm by five. Still not sure what charm does, but we'll keep going. Uh, so which way to Mangle Grove? Southwest. Let's see if they'll see any new enemies right now. Mm, these are all enemies I fought before. Ooh, hi cat. It's a kitty. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna kill the archer first because he summons backup. 15 damage? Dude, he's almost dead already. Oh, oh, he's almost dead. Come on, get a, get a turn. Thank you. Wow. He almost killed me in one turn. They almost killed me. How? I guess it was because the first one did, like, 15 damage. Are you dead yet? Alright, let's finish this guy. Alright, we should be a little better. Oh, Frolic's really. Aw, it's cute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Please don't kill the protagonist. No, 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 no! Yikes. Do I have an item that revives him? Oh no, I don't have any items. I think I need to run. Honestly. Yeah, bye. Oh, shoot. Are we gonna die? Please work. 
Okay, we're alive. Do I have any- do I have an item that revives me? I don't- I don't think I do. Yeah, I don't. Oh no, he's revived after battle. I didn't know that happened. Okay, that's- that's okay. Uh, can I use heal on myself here? Alright, let's do it again. Wow, so he- they did a lot of damage to me. Um, so that makes me think I'm a little unprepared for the upcoming enemies. Let's level up, uh, Eric to the next level at least. At the very least. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't mean to fight you again. I wanted to fight this one that I fought for. Because it's weaker. I don't know if this will be 25 experience. Though. What do you guys think? Should I... I think I'll grind off-screen. So I'll get to Mangle Grove. One hit! Wow. Okay, I'll get to Mangle Grove and then I'll see what I want to do. Hopefully, the protagonist can finish this one. Sway to and fro. Bye bye. Oh, nice. More strength. Barely any strength. More agility, definitely. More deftness, magical might, and charm. Two skill points earned. Cool. No. I'm gonna save them until I can. What am I trying to do? I'm saving my skill points until I learn. I can learn. Uh, what did I get? I got great sword guard. Oh, I got those mainly to just go in the, one of these directions. Critical hand, chance attack power is fine. Yeah, for him, I'm waiting until I can get steel. Or half inch. Because there are probably some really important things you can steal. Should I should I fight them? Oh boy. I hit the stump. I don't know what the stump does, but I feel like maybe I should attack it first. What do you guys think? Stump first. I don't know what it does, so I want to finish it before it kill me. Medicinal herb? What? He just killed all the damage I did. Not fair. You know what? I'm gonna kill the lamp right here. So. Ah. 13 damage. Kill the lamp right That's less damage than it can do. Oh boy. Can we kill the saber cup before the stump heals him? That's the biggest thing. Come on, come on. Dang it. Stop killing him! Ugh, this is bad. I think we need to get- we might need to get Pep in order to- Ow. Stop! How- how is this possible? What if we attack both of them? He'll use a medicinal herb on one and then- I don't even know. Do I need to heal? I think I need to heal. There you go, Eric. Okay, now he attacked, so I can go all in on this guy. Come on. Come on, get another turn before he heals you. Oh, he attacked us. Awesome. I think I'm able to be able to do it. Yes. Alright. I need to heal myself. And then what, I just keep attacking him and hope for the best? I think that might be my only course of action right now. Stop. Yes, he didn't heal. Oh, pep! Nice! Pepped up. Attack. Yes! Alright. 32 experience. How much do we need? We need 124. Wow. Quite a bit of ways. But uh, here's good. I'm just gonna go to Mangle Grove and I'll grind off screen. Okay, so here's Mangle Grove, and uh, we'll start the next video here. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Check out some Spider-Man videos on my channel too for our PS4. And uh, we're doing Honest Game trailers, Honest trailers, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Bridge series, and 
Dragon Ball Z abridged. So stick around for that, and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye, friends.